right, he'll catch up. All I know is that we follow the road and then we find a bridge. And then we go... Uh... Toward a mill. That's a can. That's a... This... Sounds like a bridge? Oh yes, this is a bridge. Alright. And then... Riverwood should be somewhere nearby. Cliff. And in Riverwood we're looking for the Sleeping Giant Inn. I hear a dog. Okay. Hello. Sorry about that, I got distracted by those wolves. You did find the inn though. I... Oh. Is there a building here? There is indeed. Go on up the stairs and go in. Right. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. Think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. Uh-huh. And who do we ask for rooms? Uh... Would that be you? I'm the innkeeper. It's my business to keep track of strangers. Right. Well, they don't come much stranger than us. Myth. Uh, what's the room that we're looking for? The attic room. Attic room, eh? <coughs> well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Left from where I'm standing? I assume so. There are actually two to your left. Great. I'm going to just pick this one. Well, we're here. Now what? Well, your guess is as good as mine. We wait for the friend, I suppose. So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Follow me. Speak of a Daedra, and a Daedra shall appear. As they say. You know, we could just... head back up to High Hrothgar. You're not afraid of me, are you? No. Oh, she called you out, but good, Syrah. I'm not afraid of her. Now we can talk. Oh. What was that? A wardrobe with a false back panel. Common. But useful. I... don't even want to know. The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Well, they are. Hello, friend. I am indeed the Dragonborn, Sira. I hope so, but you'll forgive me if I don't assume that something's true just because the Greybeards say so. I just handed you the horn of Jurgen Windcaller. Does that make me Dragonborn too? Of course not. That makes you rather adept at sneaking through ancient Nordic burials. Right, so what do you want with me? I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. You'd better start explaining and fast. What do the Thalmor have to do with this? I'll explain what I want when I want, got it? You'd already be dead if I didn't like the look of you when you walked in here. But I had to know if the rumors about you were true. 
I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. And that goes both ways here, Delphine. How do I know I can trust you? If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Don't mind her, she's obviously bluffing. Okay. First and arguably the most important order of business, you said the Thalmor are after you? Yes. We're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. If the Thalmor have something to do with the dragons returning, that is very important. You might have noticed that the dragonborn happens to be Ultima. I, I don't know if you've noticed. I mean, I'm the blind one, but... Why are you looking for a dragonborn? We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate Dragon Slayer. You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? I... think so? That's what it looked like from where I was standing. I know that I can absorb some sort of power from it. It might be its soul. I don't know. That's all I can say. This is no time to play the reluctant hero. You either are or aren't Dragonborn. But I'll see for myself soon enough. Oh, don't give me that. Only Thalmor deal at absolutes. So what's the part you're not telling me? Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop it. I'm... I'm going to need... some serious evidence for this rather extraordinary claim. Do you know how crazy this sounds? <laughs> a few years ago, I said almost the same thing to a colleague of mine. Well, it turned out he was right, and I was wrong. Okay. And what proof do you have? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. <laughs> What are you laughing about? Her source is trust me. Right, so where are we headed? Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. All right. I... I think I know that dragon mound. We've been to Kynes Grove. It's up on the hill. Good. Good. Now we won't have to spend time searching for it. We should get moving. There's no time to waste. All right, let's go kill us a dragon. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Oh, I thought you said we had no time to waste. Well, you're in rare form today. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help That's it. That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynesgrove. Okay. Oh, well, maybe she wasn't bluffing. Still, I don't trust her. I... I've gathered that the feeling is somewhat mutual. Ah, <sighs> gods. All right, let's go. Orgnar, I'm traveling. You've got the inn till I get back. Right. Happy trails. Okay. I'll out just this way. I heard Luke oh. and Young the other day about a thief breaking Kynes into Grove a store. It wasn't me, honest. Your choice. Delphine! 
I know I have really large ears, but I have no idea what you just said. What is it? Right, and there's one important thing that I forgot to ask you. What's so important about me being Dragonborn? Dragons are coming back, and you're a born Dragon Slayer. That's all you need to know right now. Oh, thank you. All right. Let's get going. Your crypticism is only rivaled by that of the illustrious Mythidros. Why, thank you. I'm glad that I can be of use somehow. <laughs> ah. Right, how do we get to Kynesgrove from here? Well, to your right, first of all. Um. Do me a favor and bring out your map again. Oh, that shouldn't be too bad. I will take your word for it. <laughs> I cannot believe this. I mean, we could go take a detour back up to High Rothgar if you want. And then meet her in Kynesgrove. I... I suppose, but she did say that this was sort of a... Um... A sensitive issue? Keep a sharp lookout. We Gods. can't afford any delays. I that, exactly. I am absolutely still reeling over the fact that all of her evidence for this is... Trust me, I saw it. That does not a very convincing scientific argument make. Oh, I hear crows. We must be near Windhelm. That is correct. Ah, lovely, lovely Windhelm. Oh, we could go check in on the Aretino residence while we're here. Oh, we could. Oh! Sorry. Nearly ran into your gua. Myth, did we lose Delphine along the way? Another gua. Well, how often does that happen? I think she cut across. Oh. Well, hey, at least we didn't have to... Listen to her. Oh. Delightful. Well, this is going to be interesting. I remembered how to get to Kynesgrove, I think. You did. No, you don't want to go up there. A dragon, it's attacking. A dragon is attacking Kynesgrove. Well, I don't know. Not yet. It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Come on, hurry. We might be too late. Oh, there you are. Good on you, uh, comforting the... Where are we going? Oh, it's up over the hill somewhere. That was a guar, not a dragon. Well, I have to admit, I'm not looking forward to fighting a dragon in a blizzard. Indeed. Come on. We need to find out what's happening up there. Up where? Oh. Lorcan's eyes. Look at that big bastard. I would if I could. Head down. Let's see what it does. Where are we going? And I feel like I'm going to need this out. I just have this feeling. Oh. I hear it. Where is it? Oh, this is going to be a challenge. Indeed it is. That is... Oh, 
Uh, what's happening? A dragon crawling out. Alduin Fury. Boanti Vokri has Rixed Junkuzik. Gare Sanakanir. Coming near. Full side of a king. Zu'u. Korav need no dove to hide. What? You do not even know our tongue, do you? Such arrogance to dare take for yourself the name of Dova. Zalukanir, Kredar Jur. I don't need to know. What? What? Okay, okay. Do better than that. Cree, he said. Cree. <laughs> All right. I'm not Hear my voice and despair. Uh huh. I'm hearing your voice, and also the rest of you. Oh, well, that's nice. Little help, myth. Oh, God. I see that mortal. Oh, God. Oh, this is bad. Oh god. I was just getting warmed up. Oh, oh damn. You did it. That was well done. Come on. You're right. I've been wanting a closer look at one of these buggers. You take your closer look. I'm going to take one of these. Two of those. That was hairy. Well, actually it was scaly. Miss. <laughs> this is not the time for jokes. Gods. You're right. Uh-huh. I'm a little bit singed around the edges, but... Where did the other one go? Flew off into the mist. Okay. Well, great. Wait, something's happening. God's above. Oh. Well. So you really are... Confused, yes. <laughs> and you told me not to make jokes. I mean... Okay, we can have a little bit of joking about this. So! Uh, it's true, isn't it? You really are Dragonborn. Uh-huh. It's true. Do you believe me now? I owe you some answers, don't I? Go ahead. Whatever you want to know, nothing held back. Uh, well, I, I think you also owe me an apology. Do you see what I mean now when I say I don't know if I absorb the souls of dragons or not? You see? Okay. Who are you? Delphine. And what do you want with me? I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. 
For the last two hundred years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. We need to stop them. Oh. Uh, you're a blade? You know, that sort of... Oh, gods, I hear it. I hear the other one. That sort of explains the secrecy after the whole Thalmo with the wagon full of heads thing. Sorry. Anyway, what do you know about the dragons coming back? Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Oh, uh, well... It wasn't just black. Oh? It looked like it was made from Red Mountain itself. Oh, great! So what's our next move? The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Oh, gods. What a horrifying thought. So... What makes you think that the Thalmor have anything to do with this? Besides... me. Just... obviously. Nothing solid. Yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere. Indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? Uh, presumably the dragons. I don't know, but that's a good point. Oh, gods. So we need to find out what the Thalmor know about the dragons. Do you have any ideas? If we could get into the Thalmor embassy... It's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. <laughs> oh, absolutely not. Absolutely not. You could have suggested North Watch Keep and I would have... probably not decided to go there, either. Delphine, the Thalmor did this to my face. They're the reason I can't see. I am not going anywhere near the Thalmor Embassy. I could. Miss could. I don't like that. So, how do we get in? Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Uh-huh. Where? All right. You're volunteering to walk into the Thalmor Embassy? Why not? That's my job. What? Well... I am a bit shaken. That was not a normal dragon. Oh, really? It spoke. Well, so did the other one, but... Right, this one had a name. It did. Is that what... Its name was Salokanir. Or something like that. I'm not quite sure. Salo... Salokanir? Something along those lines. Oh, gods, it's cold. <sighs> and... I'm tired. What do you mean?
mean it's your job? Will you permit me to have this secret? You know, I'm slowly but surely starting to get the impression that the less I know about you, the better. That's probably correct. Oh. It seems a soldier got caught up with this... caught up. That was not a pleasant dragon fight, I must say. It certainly wasn't. Right, we have some time to kill. What do you say we walk up to High Hrothgar and turn that horn in? After we sleep. I think that's a good idea. What do you think that big dragon was? Bad news. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Ah, <sighs> gods. <sighs> that mountain never gets any warmer. It really doesn't. Right. Which one's on gear? I think he's the one directly to your right. Oh, they're out. Up. They're up and out. They're awake. Correct. Okay. You just wait here. Oh, don't worry. I don't want to get anywhere near the way with the Greybeards. Not when they can shout me off a cliff. <laughs> Arm gear? Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Wimkola. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Oh. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. What? You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da, which means push. Oh. Da. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master Wolfgar will now gift you with his knowledge of Da. You have completed your training, Dragonborn. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards, but you are ready. Oh dear. Oh. Ingra, Rosis, Saran, Strundul, Othni, Balan, Clov, Ran, Lao. Tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. I don't know if unscathed is quite the right word for it. That was somewhat scathing. I don't know what any of that meant. That's not true. I heard Ismir in there. And I heard 
at more or something. And also Khan, which I believe is the Nordic Kine. So that was impressive. Somewhat terrifying, but impressive. Ah, uh, how so? Well, the entire mountain was shaking as far as I could tell, and you were standing in the middle of it. You tell me. Uh, right. Um... On gear? Your training proceeds well, Dragonborn. Uh, what was that ceremony all about? Why were you all shouting at me? We spoke the traditional words of greeting to a Dragonborn who has accepted our guidance. The same words were used to greet the young Talos when he came to High Hrothgar, before he became the Emperor Tiber Septim. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> yeah, that's a... that's a thing. So what did you actually say? Ah, I sometimes forget you are not versed in the dragon tongue as we are. This is a rough translation. Long has the storm crown languished, with no worthy brow to sit upon. By our breath, we bestow it now to you, in the name of Kine, in the name of Shor, and in the name of Atmora of old. You are Ismir now, the dragon of the north. Hearken to it. Well, oh, well, that's... That's sort of a, a hefty mantle. Right. I... I'd like to know more about the voice. You have learned so much already, Dragonborn. Growing your gift too quickly would be dangerous. Oh. But there are many words of power in Skyrim carved in the dragon tongue. Even from here we can feel the thum resonate from them. Finding these lost words would be a sufficient test to temper your abilities with experience. Ask when you are ready to search. Oh, that's what those are. I've learned something very... important today. Many things very important. We do have to get back to Riverwood. We do have to get back to Riverwood. Thank you, Arngir. Wind guide you. How do you say that in the dragon tongue? Uh. <laughs> right. Okay. So does this mean I have to call you Ismir? I would prefer it if you don't. That's a very Nordic title. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm not exactly a Nord. I mean, you're tall. Myth. Wait, am I taller than you? By quite a bit, actually, yes. <laughs> right, let's get going. Back down the mountain. Through the clouds, it feels like it's foggy. Foggy and snowy. Great. Great.